Hey guys, what's up everybody? This is Nerp the Ninja here, and this is a video tutorial on how to download Optifine for Minecraft 1.46 on the Mac. So, I've had trouble downloading like mods and stuff on Mac, and now I figured it out, so I want to share my knowledge with you guys, and having the Optifine mod really boosts your FPS, and also it allows you to use HD textures. MC Patcher does the same thing, but I think Optifine has more features, and it's a bit more fun to use so yeah let's dive right into the tutorial so first what you're gonna want to do is look at my computer specs just so you know this if your operating system is around mine then it's gonna work I know for like the newer version like mountain lion or something it works it's just like one of the buttons is a different place but so yeah so let's go right in so first you're going to want to open your desired web browser I use Google Chrome because it works the best for YouTube and stuff so you're there and then you're going to want to Google Optifine and click on the first one it's on the servers most of the mod texture packs the real ones are on the, ser on the Minecraft forums yeah I meant forums on servers okay so now you're here you're going to you're going to want to download the first one the ultra that has all the features of all the other ones just download that from adfly adfly is a good website for like downloading stuff just make sure you don't click on like this stuff you have to wait up here the skip ad and then you download it over here so download that and it will go to wherever your downloads are so i have mine go to my desktop to make it easier so yeah and we're going to want to test this out on a texture pack afterwards so we're just going to use the texture pack faithful because uh, it's my favorite texture pack because I like the default texture pack so this just enhances it so we're just gonna go download where is it here right here see you must install these textures with the latest version of MC Patcher or Optifine we're using Optifine okay so that's downloading and so what you want to do with your Optifine when you download just double click on that and unzip it so you're gonna have a folder like that and then your faithful ones do the same exact thing so we're gonna need to place these folders somewhere and use them okay so now we can get get out of our uh, your web browser and we're gonna open up minecraft so I could show you that it doesn't have the mod right now and it's completely uh, vanilla right now so let me just quickly log in and show you that we're just gonna hop into uh, my world and as you can see, everything is uh, normal. No zoom in the controls. No, like, all that stuff. Yeah. So, that's that. And now we're gonna, now I'm actually gonna show you how to put the mod into your Minecraft jar. So, this is where everybody gets confused and make sure you pay attention here. So, what you're gonna wanna do is make a new finder window. So, when you're here, you wanna click on where it says places on the left, click on the little house where your home computer is. So, oh yeah, there's black everywhere because it's I'm like covering my confidential information. Okay, so then what you're wanting, what you're gonna want to do is, uh, here I'll go to this mode so it's easier for you guys to see. So you're gonna want to click on library, application support, Minecraft, and then you're in the Minecraft folder. This is the folder where, where you're gonna be doing a lot of things. You're gonna be saving your worlds, like duplicating them, changing them your screenshots, your texture packs, this is pretty self-explanatory, but the bin is what you're going to want to go to for this video. So this is where your mods are held, and what you're going to want to do if you're on a Mac is take this minecraft.jar and change it. I'm going to name it minecraft.zip and use it. What this does, it makes it into a folder if you double click on it, so that way we can put the mod into it. So yeah, I just you didn't have to do that cleanup thing. So you're just going to want to open that, and this is when we're also going to want to open this Optifine mod that we unzip from that. So these two uh, are the class files. So this is the normal vanilla Minecraft class files, and this is the Optifine 1.46 class files. So we're going to want to Command A on the Optifine and Command C in the Optifine that copies all of them. And we're going to want to paste them all, Command V, into the normal Minecraft ones. So we're going to replace all the Minecraft ones with the Optifine ones. Just replace those, all of those. And now that the mod is in there, but you can't use it unless you do a minor change. So just go back to this over here. You want to change this Minecraft folder back to Minecraft.jar or it will not work. 
because for some reason it needs to be jar for it to work and this minecraft.zip can stay in there and the final thing we need to do is open that minecraft.jar and just click this button right here sort by range by kind this on mountain line or something the newer version like this like sort, sort by button is like somewhere over here like i don't know but it shouldn't be too hard to find so you click kind and then scroll down until you get the meta imp for some reason this folder corrupts like the minecraft files and like your worlds and all that so just delete it just to be safe so yeah now that should be working and everything so we are going to um try it and before we try it we're also going to put the texture pack in so to put your texture pack in just open your texture pack folder i already have faithful in there but we're just going to put a new faithful in replace it because this is faithful 1.46 okay so now we're going to test this all out let's open minecraft log in okay so as you can see in the options we have more render distances, it tells you what they are if you like put your mouse over it. That's what Optifine does, and also in the uh, controls, controls, Z for zoom. We're just going to go in my world to show you that it works, just make it big. You're going to get lag at first, the first time you use it, it might give you like a big x-ray, that's what happened to me, but it's fine, now it's, now it's good, and now like just check your FPS, mine is pretty low right now because I'm recording but should be pretty high for you and you could do Z for zoom. Looking at all the sexy piggies. Okay, so that is that. And yeah, I hope you guys know how to do that now. So now we're just gonna know, figure out how to do the texture pack. So it's very simple. Oh yeah, if you guys weren't updated to Minecraft 1.46 earlier, you could always just click options, force update. If you weren't updated, but you should be updated anyways. So we're just going to want to go to texture packs, faithful 32 pack, and now we're in faithful. So you could use your favorite texture packs. This is going to work for all of the ASG textures like Doku Craft, Faithful, Sfax Pure, like anything. So now we have just like upgraded Minecraft textures. Yep. So thanks for watching this video, guys. I hope it really helped. If it helped you at all or anything. I hope you give me a like because it really helps. I've been getting a lot of love lately from you guys. And subscribe if you like my videos. Oh yeah, well, this is a little um, funny thing. This uh, video file right here is actually on YouTube right now. That's episode 35 of my Let's Play if you've seen it already. And this is a one little clip from episode 36. And I may find diamonds. A little sneak peek. <laughs> okay guys, that's it. And also, on my screen, a lot of times you saw random uh, creepers and Minecraft stuff. I just customize all my stuff with, like, Minecraft stuff. So, yeah, I hope you all have a really cool Christmas today. I think today is Christmas, the day I'm uploading this. So, Merry Christmas to you all. And, oh yeah, let me, I'm just going right back into Minecraft because I'm pretty sure for Christmas... They changed the chests. Where are these? Yeah, right over here. I'm pretty sure they changed the chests. Yep, look. Green chests. So look, if we take a chest. Wait, where is this? Chest, chest, here. Chest. If you put them down, it's... Red. Now green. I don't know, it's pretty cool. Minecraft just did it. It's a cool thing. So... Yeah, if you want to play with those uh, presents today, go for it. So that's going to wrap up this video, and thanks for watching. See you later.